a letter to parents went out explaining what to expect with phase two. Um, we, we are talking new learning and we are talking about students uh, and assignments and submitting work evidence and having teachers give feedback. We, uh, our team at Teaching and Learning narrowed the remaining curriculum down that's left for the rest of the year uh, down to those essential nuggets of knowledge and the, the skills students will need to know as they move on to the next grade level or the course. Uh, we've made recommendations for the number of minutes that should be spent in core courses, in elective courses, in K, you know, in pre-K classrooms and all that. Um, we have provided guidance for delivery of instruction and learning experiences, activities, performance tasks, digital resources to use, and learning extensions. Special programs, uh, this will look different too. We're focused on providing a continuity of services and with intentional plans that are being made to meet the individual needs of students. We've gotten lots of questions about what does phase two look like for my kids that receive related services or um, resource instruction? Uh, what is that support gonna look like? So right now, as we speak, um, all day long um, and the coming couple of days, our special ed staff is creating individualized lesson plans for every student based on their IEP. So we're looking at IEP goals, we're looking at the services that they receive. We will be providing um, Zoom instruction will be providing resources for students to practice and continue their learning. Um, so, you know, we've been asked the question, is th speech therapy going to be happening? Yes, um, our speech teachers are thrilled to begin to work with students, as are all of our special program staff. Um, so we are looking forward to that. Um, you know, as Dr. Bent says, we are um, providing a continuity of services. We recognize this is going to look different from home. Um, we know that our families are balancing being parents as well as working. Um, and so we want to make sure that we're meeting the needs of our students and keeping all of that in mind. Um, our general ed staff and our special program staff are working collaboratively to make sure that we have great plans for kids.